who would like to take the first go at speaking a cue card? You can pick any cue card of your choice. Ashok, would you like to take a take the first go? Uh, no problem, ma'am. Actually, I haven't seen any uh, any cue card. I just uh, took I uh, speaking. Have, I have opened the file. You can okay. pick up any from here. Okay. And prepare. All of you, anybody who wants to speak, pick up any from the file open in front of you and you can speak. Uh, I can speak from uh, sequence wise. Yes, any one, one chance you will get today na, in this class. Yeah. Other students so, also. Describe something that you did with someone. So, okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, these are two minutes I will take. Okay. Anybody who is ready to speak so that we don't waste any time. Steam, a piece of technology. All right. Which, which number? 16, a piece of technology that I find difficult to do use. Okay, okay, start. Yeah. I would like to talk about a piece of technology that I find uh, difficulty to use for the first time. Actually, I bought a um, HP desktop uh, printer through online uh, two years ago. Uh, when I was uh, unboxing that um, printer, um, I thought uh, it was easy to install. But um, after hours, uh, uh, I had spent to fix that one. Um, I couldn't uh, uh, install that properly. So I was really upset and worried. Then uh, uh, I searched on the YouTube um, so that I would get some ideas. Um, anyhow, uh, luckily I encountered, uh, I came across a very interesting video uh, that was really easy. All I was did, uh, I just uh, pressed the cancel button and Wi-Fi button uh, for three minutes. Then I, on the display bar, there was a blink. Uh, then I connected this printer with my Wi-Fi. Then I installed uh, this HP DeskJet app on my uh, mobile phone. Then finally, uh, I took printout. Mm -hmm. I was really happy. Uh, also, I had a great sigh of relief. Um, so uh, it was my experience regarding um, a piece of technology that I found real difficulty to use for the very first time. Uh, I think it is little short of two minutes, but that doesn't matter. You spoke very well on the whole that you find that you found little difficulty to use. You've used this twice. Uh, it should not be difficulty. It should be difficult. Okay. okay. Otherwise, Nigel, uh, there is no need of a review. I think you spoke perfectly well and everything went well. And your confidence has also grown and you're not dragging. I remember the last time you did speaking. I remember yes. it's a it's a um, massive improvement from that. This time, surely you 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 should get a very good score in speaking. Okay, man, thank you. I need your blessings. Yeah, they're always there with you, and uh, mm -hmm. you you've really improved. You know that. You know that. Other people uh, in your uh, group must be telling you that that your English has improved a lot. Okay? Yes. It's it's all your hard work actually. I've seen you work hard. Okay. Right. Next, who is, who's uh, going to speak now? So, ma, yes. I will take the lead. Uh, yes. I remember the time when I was pursuing my doctorate program uh, from 2017 to 2020 uh, project. It was a project on biofuels project. And uh, I, I did my project with uh, my colleagues, lab mates, and my guide. So, I worked as a leader and uh, we all collaborated as a teamwork and uh, we have achieved a patent, a lot of research papers. Apart from that, uh, it was a very uh, great work. So even our work, our work was recognized by international communities. And uh, during this project, I have learned uh, various kind of things like uh, teamwork, leadership, 
patients and etc so this this was a great project that i did in first time in my life that was a really a great experience uh, moreover these kind of people uh, always taught me various things that i never learned before uh, such as molecular biology my, mo- microbiology and uh, how to handle a wet lab so these are these some kind of projects that i did uh, with other people so it's a light it's a, such a cooperation and a teamwork so i really appreciate my this kind of work in my life and i always felt happy whenever i see my uh, photographs with my teammates okay is that it yeah yeah ma'am. it's two minutes also uh, sunny you went really well you spoke full two minutes that is perfectly good okay confidence and volume uh, is also very good the flow is very good but there were grammatical errors so i'm playing it back to tell you all of those okay okay and at places uh, the words were mumbled there was some articulation near you know you go too fast at places and there the words are not properly articulated okay so that you will you will see when i play your feedback okay and okay. what was your cue card now first uh, describe something that you did with someone so you uh, should put, you should also put in what they did in that project you didn't put in any of their efforts in it okay you did with somebody it was a team work what did they do and what did you do how you collaborated how you grouped things okay their role your okay. role that was lacking so that was some flaw in the task achievement okay you okay, did you with are, someone uh, you say i did, okay. i did with two of my colleagues okay i did with two of my class fellows like that something you have to say like that okay and they okay. they collected all the details and i did this iphone please stop drawing these lines okay okay <laughs> this is somebody else okay i was putting my doctorate program uh, from 2017 to 2000 Twenty twenty uh, project. It was a project on biofuels project, and uh, I I did my project. See, it was a project on biofuels project. It was a project on biofuels. Why you have to need need to say project again? Okay, it was okay. a biofuels project. Yeah, it was a project on biofuels. Okay. Project word you should use only once here, right? Okay. My colleagues, lab mates, and my guide. so i worked as a leader and uh, we all collaborated as a teamwork and uh, we we all collaborated as a teamwork or we all collaborated as a team okay ma'am as a team okay but the data a lot of research papers apart from that uh, it was a very uh, great work so even uh, our our work was recognized by international communities and uh, during this project i have learned all various see during this project now you are telling the time okay, okay. during this project you did it you have already mentioned the time 2017 to 2020 okay. so i have learned present perfect tense you use present present perfect when you don't mention the time okay ma'am so during this project i learned not have learned that would be wrong okay okay you have to use simple past kind of thing like uh, teamwork leadership patience and etc and etc and etc okay. is wrong you know that yeah ma'am so teamwork patience leadership etc or teamwork patience leadership and so on okay okay while listening to it listening back i can see that you have uh, uh, written uh, you have talked about the team work so i was wrong there i think you've talked enough about the team effort and all so you don't need to work on that Ta- task achievement was good okay okay ma'am sorry i missed it out for first yeah so this this was a great project that i did uh, in first time in my life that was a really a great experience Uh, moreover he that i did first time that i had done first time okay in okay. my 
these kind of people's uh, always taught me with people's people's okay wrong english person is singular okay. people is plural okay okay so you can say things that i never learned before that i had never learned before because this is past tense and okay. you are talking about before that time and you are not mentioning that so it's past past perfect that i had never learned before these kind of people mat bolo okay. so my group my team taught me many things okay i had never learned before uh, such as molecular biology my mo microbiology and uh, how to handle a wet lab so so how to handle what wet lab wet lab okay these are these some kind of projects that these are these some there there is extra these are some kind of projects okay with, uh, with other people so it's a like it's a, such a cooperation and a teamwork so i really appreciate my this kind of work in my life aap apne kaam ko appreciate nahi karte i am really proud of this work in my life that i have done okay appreciate aur log karte na aapke kaam ko aap apne okay. ko, uh proud ho sakte ho uske bare mein you can you know feel good about it but appreciate you do you don't matlab uh, you feel proud of it like appreciate somebody else will do other people appreciated your work you've said that okay okay i always felt happy whenever i see My... ओके okay, अगर आप हिंदी में बोलोगे जब मैं इसको देखता हूँ तो मैं खुश होता था कि खुश होता हूँ होता हूँ आई फील हैप्पी व्हेन आई सी दिस वर्क ऑफ माइंड ओके आई फेल्ट ठीक है आई वेल ओके आई फील व्हेन एवर आई सी माई वर्क आई फील हैप्पी अबाउट इट ओके ठीक है अशोक यू स्पोक वेल ऑन द होल आई थिंक इट शुड गो बिटवीन सिक्स एंड सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव ओके okay ma'am always a range it is a subjective marking but if you work little okay. bit you will be okay you will be good at it okay just make up stories for all the cue cards that are there in this file okay do okay. all of them and uh, you will be good so ashok are you ready okay. yes ma'am all right now you may start okay uh, uh, being a nursing officer it is very difficult to maintain the uh, daily routine uh and uh, here i would like to uh, talk about uh, my daily routine that i really love to do uh, that is uh, my exercise routine um, i really love to do it uh, because uh, as a, as a medical professionals i know what is the value of it and uh, what kind of benefits i'm getting uh, doing it uh, so uh, at uh, that depends on my uh, duty shift it's very difficult to maintain uh, sorry it's very difficult to maintain as i am doing uh, shift wise work uh, so when i have morning duties i usually go in the evening and it's really great time for me uh, to enjoy my daily routine uh, uh, you know exercise gives me uh, motivation and inspiration and that uh, uh, keep me uh, that that always keep me on a on a pace uh, and i feel so energetic uh, to do all uh, rest of my routines like uh, go for duty and uh, do a lot of things there and it also makes me uh, relaxed so i can handle the you know stressful situation uh, so i think that all leads uh, uh, that all because of my exercise and uh, as a medical professional uh, i always read about uh, the up to date information regarding the exercise and its benefits so um, <clears throat> i also love to share with people uh, those who are like uh, my in in my group in my friend zone and uh, with my colleagues uh, they really appreciate the things that uh, i am uh, you know spreading this information and that is really good uh, for the society and for the people very good you went on for 1 minute and 50 seconds uh, you started off on a very good note it was very very uh, very nice a slight grammatical errors in between uh, but uh, ashok i don't think uh, you uh, you are running short of ideas you know it started fast and then the consistency was gone you were looking yes, for things to speak right yes ma'am what else can... so you know what what you have to do is go through all the cue cards at least the first 30 40 in this file nicely 
and make okay. up stories for what you have to speak if you get this cue card. And it is not necessary that you go on speaking on that topic only. You can divert here and there. You can expand. Like you say exercise, you could expand on the exercises. And you are a medical professional. You can talk some medical jargon here. Let the examiner feel impressed. You could say, um, you know, endorphins are released when you do exercise and these are feel good hormones and everybody feels good after, you know, uh, doing exercise. I didn't realize this until, you know, uh, my friend motivated me. Make up a story like that. Who's going to come and check? Okay. And yes, uh, once I started doing exercise, now it has become a part and parcel of my life. I feel incomplete without it. Uh, I, I have very busy schedule, but I still uh, take out time for my daily exercise. And then you can expand on what exercises you do. You can say once or twice a week, I do yoga. Once or twice a week, I do weight training. And I do um, running for two, uh, twice a week. Okay. I run about six, seven miles um, in a park near my home. And I feel so good after it. I sweat out all my stress and worry on those running days. You can see, see so much I spoke now. You could have spoken yes. so much. So the, this is what you have to accumulate for all the cue cards, how you can expand on them so that two minutes, uh, you know, they shouldn't seem long two minutes. They should just pass. You You should have the, you know, things to speak for more than two, three minutes. Okay. Examiner should stop you. You should not uh, be the one to, you know, repeat, start repeating things and then the examiner stops you. Okay. So just yeah, work on that. You'll be good. Fine. Who is Thank next? You. Who is next? Oh, I did I play back your uh, speak uh, audio? No, ma'am. I'll just play back. Okay. Uh, being a nursing officer, it is very difficult to maintain the uh, daily routine. Uh, and uh, here, I would like to talk about uh, my daily routine that I really love to do. Uh, that is uh, my exercise routine. Um, I really love to do it uh, because uh, as, as a medical business, I know what is the value of it. And uh, Where you spoke as a medical, what word did you speak after that? As a medical professional? Professional. The articulation. I profession not hear my profession. Medical professional. Okay, speak it, articulate it well. Okay, the word should be articulated nicely. I know benefits I'm getting uh, doing it. Uh, so, uh, that, uh, that depends on my duty. It's very difficult to maintain. Uh, it's very difficult to maintain as I'm doing uh, twice work. Uh, so, when I have morning duties, I usually go in the evening, and it's really great time for me uh, to enjoy my daily routine. Uh, uh, you know, exercise gives me uh, motivation and inspiration, and that uh, uh, gives me. Uh, and that always keeps me on a and that keeps me not keep me okay keeps me uh, and i feel so energetic uh, to do all the rest of my routines like uh, go for duty and uh, do a lot of things there you said i feel so energetic now all of you just listen one thing there is a cambridge book step up to ielts self study cambridge book one whole chapter is dedicated to the word so and such okay so and such are always followed by that. I feel uh, like if you say she's so beautiful uh, and you say she's very beautiful, she's very beautiful is a complete sentence. She's so beautiful is an incomplete sentence. Hindi karo, wo itni sundar hai. Ke, mera dil karta usko dekhta hi jau. That I feel like looking at her all the time. She's so beautiful. That is incomplete without the that clause. Yeah. Okay. And I she, feel so energetic. I energetic feel very energetic. Can. It should be yeah. very energetic. Or it should be, I feel so energetic that I am, uh, you know, I I, I do my uh, duty full mm -hmm. of uh, energy. Okay. Full yeah. of uh, zeal. I can do, uh, you know, uh, I don't feel tired over there. Something else you have to add after that. If you use the word so. So, so and such is for everybody to learn. Many students uh, need to learn this point, right? It also makes me uh, relax so I can handle. When you have to talk of your feeling, it should always be ED form. It also makes me relaxed, not relax, relaxed. Okay. You know, stressful situation. 
Uh, so I think that all leads, uh, uh, that all because of my exercise. And uh, as a medical professor, sir, I always read about... Uh, Here also, your medical professions gaya, professional. As a medical professional, okay? The up-to-date yeah. information regarding the exercise and its benefits. So, um, I also love to share with people, uh, those who are like uh, my, in my group, in my friend zone, and with my colleagues, uh, they really appreciate the things that uh, I am uh, you know, spreading this information, and that is really good for the society and for the people. Very good. You went on for one minute. All right. Uh, next. Ma'am, may I? Yes, yes. Sure. Who is that? Uh, my name is Ramandeep Kaur. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the cue card was describe a piece of good news you heard from others. Cue card is, not was. Okay. Chalo. Start. 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 Uh, yes, ma'am. We have a school staff group on WhatsApp in which our school principal recently sent a message that of a school student, Ishan Rathod of class 8, got five rating and become first rated player of Vivek Anand Vidya Vihar in chess competition. So this was a very good news for all of us. It was a proud moment and we can spread this news everywhere. We congratulations for his future. Mom, that's it. You haven't spoken much. It's only 40 seconds. You've got to go on for two minutes. It's okay. I'll give you the feedback for that much. Okay. Um, yes, okay. So what was your cue card in the first place? Uh, describe a piece of good news you heard from others, ma'am. Okay. Start. Uh, yes, ma'am. We have a school staff group on WhatsApp in which a school principal recently sent a message that of a school student, Ishan Rathod of class A, got five rating and become first rated player of Vivek Anand Vidya Vihar in such competition. So this was a very good news for all of us. It was a proud moment and we can spread this news every. We can spread the and we spread this news in all of our other groups also. Okay? Can spread ni kar sakte ya thodi. Aapne kari spread. Right? Congratulations for his future. We congratulated him. Not congratulation. Okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Uh, beta, aap, aap new oils mein? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So you have to speak for two minutes on this uh, cue card. This is the second part of the speaking. There are three parts on the speaking. Intro, intro, sure, ma'am. Right at the follow-up. So two minutes, you have to prepare uh, the cue cards for two minutes. And yes, uh, uh, you'll have to speak two minutes over there. The examiner may stop you in between, but uh, if he doesn't, you have to go on for a whole two minutes. Okay. Definitely. Who is yes, next? Who is next? Me. Uh, Jatin Sani. Yes, Jatin. Which you can uh, uh, describe a time when you complained about something. Okay. Start. Well, I'm a kind of uh, person who do not like to complain a lot. But when I feel something is not done in a right way, I feel it's my responsibility to get it correct because a complaint about it will make sure it doesn't happen again. And today I would like to talk about uh, the time when I complained about something and eventually got it correct. It happened during the last month uh, when I ordered uh, a jacket from uh, an online thrift store and uh, and it just arrived uh, at my uh, courier service. And when I went to courier service and asked about my parcel, the receptionist said, we were founding uh, your parcel and uh, there were lots of stuff there. And I went to the courier service service again. He again said that the same thing again. And for two or three days, he was, uh, the receptionist was playing game and uh, using a new excuses for uh, the parcel. 
that's when i went home and immediately call call the manager of the courier service and said everything what he was saying and within the next two hour i received a call from the courier service and when i went there the receptionist immediately hand my parcel and he said sir here is uh, the parcel and it uh, and it was there and uh, and the workers didn't find find that and he was also saying to take back the complaint at first i was angry but very calmly i say listen it's the it's the responsibility that you need to take and uh, hope sure uh, and i uh, and i again told him to not uh, doing doing this type of thing in the nearby right. future and okay. take the responsibility in a good way two minutes six two minutes also learn to stop when the examiner stops you okay okay look at that okay all right jatin you brought in too much of reported speech in your cue card and that spoiled it all for you i always tell in all my classes don't try don't bring in reported speech where you can do without it ओके रिपोर्टेड स्पीच क्या होती है उसने मुझे बोला मैंने उसको बोला उसे एवरीवेयर इट वेंट रॉन्ग ओके सो अवॉइड द यूज ऑफ रिपोर्टेड स्पीच इफ यू हैव टू यूज इट एट ऑल लर्न डू इट वेरी वेल ओके सो आई एम प्लेइंग इट बैक एंड आई टेल यू वेयर ऑल यू वेंट रॉन्ग राइट स्टार्ट वेल आई एम अ पर्सन हु डू नॉट लाइक टू कंप्लेन अ लॉट Who does not like to? Two के बाद complaint नहीं आ सकता. Complain आएगा. Verb आएगा. Complain a lot. Okay. But when I feel something is not done in a right way, I feel it's my responsibility to. Get... When I feel something is not done in a right way, नहीं in the right way, I feel it is my responsibility. Correct. Because I complain about it to make sure it doesn't happen again. And today, I would like to talk about uh, the time when I complained about something and eventually got it correct. It happened during the eventually got it corrected. Okay. Last month, uh, when I ordered uh, a jacket from uh, an online thrift store, and uh, and it just arrived uh, at my courier service, and when I went to courier service and asked about my parcel, the receptionist said. We were finding uh, your parcel, and uh, there were lots of stuff there. And the receptionist told me that she could not locate my parcel. That is it. Okay. Then uh, went to the uh, courier service uh, service again. He again say that the same thing again. I went the next day. I went again and again. I was given the same reply that my parcel could not be traced. Okay. And for two or three days, he was uh, the receptionist was playing game and uh, using the uh, new excuses for uh, the parcel. That's when I went home and immediately uh, call uh, call the manager of the courier service and uh, said everything what he was and said everything and told him everything that had happened. Okay. And within the next two hour, I received a call from the courier service. And when I went there, the receptionist immediately hand my. Uh, the receptionist immediately handed my parcel. And he said, "Sir, here is uh, the parcel." ये क्या जरूरत थी बोलने की? Immediately handed me the parcel. Okay, that is it. And it uh, Hello, there and. Uh, And the workers didn't find find that, and he was also saying to take back the complaint. He handed me the parcel and told me that it had come under some other other parcel, so so we so they could not find it. Okay, like that. First, I was angry, but very calmly I said, "Listen, it's the it's the response." I say, "Listen, it's." आप उनको बोल रहे हो उस टाइम जो बोला आप वैसे ही बोल रहे हो. I told them to be careful in future. Okay. I was very calm and I told them to be careful in future. Responsibility that you need to take. That they needed to take. Reported speech, puri galat jari aapki. Okay, try to avoid it as much as possible. I hope it's clear to you, Jatin. Okay. Hello, ma'am. 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 Hello, ma'am.
हेलो मैम आकाश पटेल हेलो मैम यस हेलो फर्स्ट आई थिंक रितुल योर हैंड वाज अप रितुल व्हिच क्यू कार्ड आर यू वांट यस मैम 19th जतिन यू कैन पुट योर हैंड डाउन नाउ ओके रितुल यू कैन स्टार्ट हेलो मैम टू बी हेलो मैम आई एम न्यू हियर इज आई वांट टू स्पीक हियर या यू कैन स्पीक नेक्स्ट अली ओके ओके रितुल स्पीक फर्स्ट to be success in life a uh, person have to ek minute ritul ab ab shuru karo jab maine bola apne karani ab karo shuru ha okay to be success in life person have to do lot of hard work here i would like to talk about an achievement which i achieved when i was 10 year old uh, at that time i was listening about abacus classes uh, uh, from my friends and suddenly our principal came and she told about uh, abacus classes that it should be held out, uh, next week uh, then i uh, took uh, then i took permission from my parents and they allowed me to take part in uh, abacus uh, and uh, it was of it was the course of 3 month in which uh, i had completed four to five books of uh, abacus uh, and that after that there was an exam held uh, which was in chandigarh i went there and i participated in that exam uh after completion of that exam uh, result was declared after 5 year 5 uh, hours uh, mm -hmm. one of the uh, one of the girl who was from uh, delhi she was first uh, all over the india uh, and uh, uh, at that time i started crying uh, when i went uh, to school next day uh, our principal came to the stage and she uh, started uh, giving the speech and she announced my uh, name Uh, and told uh, all of the student that um, i was i was the second in that exam all over the india even uh, in himachal i took first place uh, uh, at that time um, i was uh, at that time i was feeling very proud and uh, uh, and uh, i got i got the trophy uh, then i told to my parents even they feel, uh, they also feel very very proud uh this was the proud moment uh, in which uh, uh, I, i i achieved all right uh, you went on for full two minutes your volume was very good consistency was very good uh, you uh, st uh, started your cue card with the same uh, speed uh, speed and finished it with the same speed that was all very good that means you are working on these things but ritul uh, you made quite a few grammatical errors which i'm going to play back and tell you all right okay. कामयाबी है ना अब आपने कामयाबी होना है लाइफ में कामयाब होना है कामयाब की इंग्लिश क्या है सक्सेस वो तो कामयाबी है आपने ही बोला अभी <laughs> है ना एनी बडी हेल्स सक्सेसफुल सक्सेसफुल मैम यस यस सो टू बी सक्सेस इन लाइफ थोड़ी टू बी टू बी सक्सेसफुल इन लाइफ ओके lot of hard work here i would like to talk about an achievement which i achieved when i was 10 year old uh, at that time i was listening about abacus classes uh, uh, from my friends and suddenly our principal came and she told about uh, abacus classes that it should be held out abacus hota hai ke abacus hota hai mere ko na iski pronunciation check karni hai okay let me see राइट All right. Next week, 
uh, then I uh, took uh, then I took permission from my parents and they allowed me to take part in uh, Abacus. Uh, and uh, it was the uh, course of three months in which uh, I had completed four to five. Three ke baad three three ke baad month hana chahiye ke months hana chahiye. Three months of uh, Abacus. Um, and that after that. Ritul, ye ab dekh lo. Abacus ko ab thik kar lena. Bolna yes, is the exam mein, but it should be Abacus. Abacus, okay. There was an exam held, uh, which was in Chandigarh. I went there and I participated in that exam. Uh, after you don't, you, you don't participate in an exam. You participate in a competition. You take the exam. I went there and I took the exam. Took the test. Okay. Okay, okay ma'am. Uh, one of the girls from Delhi had stood first. He was first uh, all over the India. All over? Uh, all over India. The India is wrong English. The doesn't come before any names of countries or cities except for a few. Okay. Which I make all my uh, academic students do very nicely. Uh, will anybody tell them the kis kis ke pehle aana hai? Uh, the UK, USA. Hmm, the UK, the US, the UAE, the Middle East, mm -hmm. the Russian the Republic, the Czech Republic, the Netherlands. Uh, the Maldives. The Maldives, okay. Uh, at that time, I started crying. Uh, when I went uh, to school next day, uh, our principal came to the stage and she uh, started uh, giving the speech and she announced my uh, name uh, and told uh, all of the students that uh, I was I was the second in that exam all over the I was the second in the exam all over the India I was second all over India okay I had attained the second place all over India okay yeah. Even uh, in Himachal, I took first place. Uh, uh, at that time, um, I was uh, at that time I was feeling very proud and uh, uh, and. Uh, at that time, I felt very proud. Okay. I got I got the trophy. Uh, then I told to my parents. Even they feel uh, they, they. Then I told to my parents. Nee? Then I told my parents to Niana. Okay. Also feel very very proud. Uh, they also felt the very proud. Okay. Proud moment uh, in which uh, uh, I uh, I achieved. All right. Uh, uh, you went on. For okay. Uh, Ritul, Hello. I would say with all these mistakes will not go above a six. आपको बहुत mistakes हुई हैं आपको पता चल गई है ना सारी. Yes, ma'am. Examiner subjective marking है छः से कम का नहीं है मैं फिर भी छः से साढ़े छः का range दूँगी. More towards six, hai, but uh, take care of these mistakes which you have done today. Okay. Hello. Uh, yes. Um, yes. 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 Hello. 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 Ali ne ye bolna hai. Pehle Aksh ne bolna hai. Yes, sir. All right. Khushbu, aapne bhi bolna hai. Yes, ma'am. All right. All right. So, um, yes. Um, um, Ali, aaj, aaj hi aapne join kara na. Pehle old students inko bolna do. Phir aapko turn deti ho. Okay. Khushbu, you can take the first go and Aksh next. Okay. Jino ne bol liya. Lower your hand now. Yes. Ma'am, question number eight. Okay. Describe a person who inspired you to do something interesting. Hello. Uh, well, there are a number of people who inspired me for doing good deed. However, today I would like to talk about a special person who always inspired me to do an interesting thing. She is none other than my mother. Her name is Gauri. She always says me, and give advice to help needy people. In my perspective, motivated motivation uh, is just uh, give you a boost for doing something. 
and why i am motivated by her is just because of her loving nature towards animal and people she helps people not by giving food but also by giving financial support in this uh, 24th century uh, it is very difficult to trust anyone but my mother inspired me to give 30% of your earning to uh, needy people as a donation or a or to give to an ngo so in future if i get a chance i will definitely give uh, my 30% earning to uh, ngos as a donation and just because of her uh, i visit once in a week to temple and give uh, food and clothes to people that's it all right uh, kushbu you have to work on your subject verb agreement okay that has wrong, gone wrong in many places you spoke only one and a half minute ek to aapke taiyari nahi hai aapko two two minutes you have to prepare mess, uh, you know matter for two minutes more than two minutes okay in fact when you are preparing okay when you are speaking on your own go on for two and a half minutes for all cue cards okay um there is some disturbance there in somebody okay so i'm going to play it back and tell you the feedback so then there are a number of people who inspired me for doing good deed however today i would like to talk about a special person who always inspired me to do an interesting thing see you She's said a special person who always inspire me a special person is singular so verb should have an s who always inspires me there should be an s here this is subject verb agreement okay, okay so then my mother her name is sorry she always says me and give advice to help needy people give advice me gives advice okay she always gives me advice to help the needy the needy hota hai in my perspective motivated motivation uh, is just uh, give you a boost for doing something motivation is uncountable it it should be followed by an s verb motivation gives you a boost not give you okay and why i am motivated by her is just because of her loving nature towards animal and people towards She animals and people animal nahi animals इंस्पायर्स मी तो ट्रस्ट ट्रस्ट अदर पीपल बट माय मदर ट्रस्ट का क्या मतलब है आपने बोला कि ट्रस्ट करना नहीं और पर मेरी मम्मी ने इंस्पायर करा कि थर्टी परसेंट दू तो ये ट्रस्ट थोड़ी इसमें आता है बट तो तब आता है ना जैसे मेनी पीपल डोंट यू नो गिव मनी टू दुअर बट माय मदर इंस्पायर्ड मी टू गिव थर्टी परसेंट ऑफ माई सेविंग्स टू दुअर थर्टी परसेंट इज ए बिग अमाउंट थर्टी परसेंट बोला उन्होंने कभी सच में अच्छा that's nice okay your earning to of okay. your earning nahi of my earning when you report a speech reported speech galat aa rahi hai unhone aapko bola na 30% of your earning do aapne bolna hai kisi ko bata rahe ho aap bologe she inspired me to give 30% of my earning to the poor okay okay needy people as a donation or a or to give to an angel so in future if i get a chance i will definitely give uh, my 30% earning to uh, ngos as a donation and just because of her uh, i visit once in a week to temple and give uh, i visit the temple once in a week two temple nahi hota i visit the i visit the temple once a week okay but he inspired to do something interesting mai mujhe nahi hai bahut acha laga टास्क अचीवमेंट में कुछ इंटरेस्टिंग इंस्पायर यू टू डू समथिंग इंटरेस्टिंग कुछ इंटरेस्टिंग सा बताओ ना इंटरेस्टिंग सुनने में भी इंटरेस्टिंग लगे ओके 
जस्ट uh, मतलब ये इंटरेस्टिंग में कोई चीज बनानी सिखाई या कोई कुकिंग में कोई चीज सिखाई कुछ यूनिक सी दैट वाज आई फाउंड इट वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग ओके और आपने कोई आर्ट एंड क्राफ्ट में कुछ इंटरेस्टिंग सिखाया या कुछ यू नो कोई अलग तरह का कोई किसी ने कोई आपको डांस सिखाया और उसे इंस्पायर करा टू डू दैट इज इंटरेस्टिंग दैट यू नो विच यू लव टू डू और यू फाइंड गुड टू डू लाइक दैट इंटरेस्टिंग एनी वेज वो भी बोल दो पर अपनी ग्रामेटिकल एरर्स का ध्यान रखो ठीक है नेक्स्ट अक्ष विच क्यू कार्ड उड uh, जनरल एप्टीट्यूड टेस्ट इन इंजीनियरिंग एग्जाम वेन आई वॉज परस्यूइंग इन माई थर्ड इयर ऑफ बेचलर माई पेरेंट्स एनकरेज मी टू गो मुंबई फॉर हायर एजुकेशन इन मास्टर्स प्रोग्राम इट वॉज अपील टैक्स फॉर मी बट बट बाई डूइंग द स्टडी आई स्टार्ट टेकिंग सम एप्टीट्यूड टेस्ट आई लीव नो स्टोन अंटर एंड Uh, with regular uh, practice all subjects i pass with flying colors and i become eligible for a mumbai uh, indian institute of technology mumbai uh, i am so i am so excited about my studies and i pay, i felt that uh, hard work is paid of my hard work is paid of my and i have open my doors to my bright future everyone's relatives and uh, my parents encourage me uh, congratulate me and everyone was uh, asked me to guide their children to bright a future and they praised me in front of my parents my parents were not only uh, over the moon but also proud of me uh, as uh, moreover uh, my parents uh, gifted me a one iphone that time i was i think on a kick and that moment uh, i uh, that moment uh, I achievement success. I am proud of you. All right. Uh, Aksh, आपना idioms आपने चार पांच जट डालने हैं बीच में. अब अपनी grammatical errors का भी count करना कितनी हुई है. Okay? अभी मैं सारी बताती जाऊँगी. उनको एक-एक line डालते जाना जितनी हुए. Count करना कितनी हुई है. इतनी ग्रामेटिकल एरर्स करोगे इडियम्स डालने की वजह से आपकी दो चार एक्स्ट्रा हुई है ओके तो आई वुड सजेस्ट कि इडियम्स वगैरह को भूल जाओ और ग्रामेटिकल एरर्स को कम करने पे फोकस करो इफ यू वांट टू स्कोर वेल ओके विथ सो मेनी ग्रामेटिकल एरर्स ग्रेस नेक्स्ट आपकी टर्न है विथ सो मेनी ग्रामेटिकल एरर्स यू यू कैन नॉट यू नो स्कोर हाई ओके इवन विद सो मेनी इडियम्स इन इट क्या बोला आपने लाइफ इज रोलर कोस्टर राइड लाइफ इज अ रोलर कोस्टर राइड और रोलर कोस्टर को भी बड़ी तेज तेज बोल रहे हो तो ये पहला इडियम था आपने जो डाला उसने एक ग्रामेटिकल एरर करी है मार्क वन ओके एवरी वन शुड है गोल ये बोला आपने Every success has a what? वो क्या बोला आपने? Struggle story. Okay. My general attitude and taste in engineering exam. When I was pursuing in my third year of bachelor. When I was pursuing in my in any ana my third years of bachelor's. Okay, year of bachelor. 
to go Mumbai for higher education in master program. Uh, it was a uphill task for me, but uh, it was an uphill task for me. But yeah, both days or wo pata nahi chalta aapko articles beech mein se kha rahe ho, okay? Uh, but uh, by doing the study, uh, I started taking some uh, practical days. Uh, I leave no stone unturned. I left. Uh, I leave no stone unturned. Nee, I left no stone unturned to prepare for those tests. Okay. Okay. I became eligible for. Okay. Not become. Okay. It's all subjects. I passed with flying colors and I become eligible for a Mumbai uh, Indian Institute of Technology Mumbai. I a uh, Mumbai India Institute of Technology Mumbai. I became eligible to study in IIT Mumbai. Okay. I am so I am so excited about my studies. I was so excited. I am so nay was. And I think I think that uh, hard work is paid off my hard work is paid off my and I hard work is paid off my friend. Kya, kya, kya hard work paid. I felt that my hard work paid off. And I have opened doors to my bright future. I'm both ye Sarai Galat Bulabne. You know, my hard work paid and I, I passed with flying colors. Nahi bolna shayeta. Barbar thodi boloke. Open my doors to my bright future. Everyone's relatives and uh, my parents encouraged me, uh, congratulate me. Congratulated me. Congratulate me. But if 5.5 to 6 ke beach me jayega jo apne aaj bola. Forget the idioms. Focus on your grammar and focus on good articulation. Aapke words aise karke sunne padte hain. Aise nahi sunne padne chahiye examiner ko. Okay? All words should be articulated loud and clear. Okay? Nicely. Yes, Grace, your turn. Which cue card? Ma'am, um, 17th, describe a historical period you would like to know more about. Start. History was not my favorite subject, but uh, there was a song which was released by a famous singer, Sidhu Musewala. He talked, his, his song was a war and he mentioned a great warrior about, uh, his name was uh, Hari Singh Nalua. And I got fascinated by that song and I wanted to know about it. When I read a book about uh, on him, I come to know that he was a great warrior during the time of Maharaja Ranji Singh Ji. He was a great ruler at that time. I have heard so many stories about him, but there was so many glimpses about him which are still hidden and there were not so there are not so many books. I tried to search on the Google, but there was not enough information about that time. I come to know, I heard from my parents that that time he ruled in such a manner that there was a peace everywhere and everyone was treated with the equality and there was no poverty. Everyone was educated. Though he was not very educated, but still he managed to rule a such huge kingdom. He, he, he won many countries. He, he, he expanded his areas, boundaries to the Afghanistan and in India. He has ruled, uh, he has increased his boundaries to Delhi and Bihar, which was very great. And I want to know how he ruled it, how he managed all the, how he managed the strategies and how he ma made such great warriors. There was not only a, one warrior, Hari Singh Nalwa, there were many more, like Aluwalia and many more. There were many missiles were created at that time. I am very curious to know about those days and Grace, you spoke to on whom on whom did you speak? Hari Singh Nalwa or Maharaja Ranjit Singh? This is the cue card on the period, not on a person. So I mentioned the period when Maharaja Ranjit Singh ruled, and during that time there was a Hari Singh Nalwa. He was a warrior of his kingdom. Let me play it back. History was not my favorite subject, 
but uh, there was a song which was released by a famous singer Sidhu Musewala he talked this song was a war and he mentioned a great warrior about and uh, his name was uh, Hari Singh Nalua and i got fascinated by that song and i wanted to know about it then i read a book about about it me aa raha hai na to fir wo Hari Singh Nalua hi aa raha hai yahan pe About that period in which there were warriors like Hari Singh Nalwa. So, here, say it. Say it. Take it. Take it. Expand. Do it. Okay. Okay. Uh, on him, I come to know that he was a great warrior. See the again, you are expanding the next line. Maybe that is Hari Singh Nalwa. Are you expanding? Time time period. Ke baare mein to bola hi nahi hai. My battery is going to die. Just one second. आपने पहले पहले शुरू से ही कुछ एक्सपैंड नहीं कर टिल द एंड आई कुड नॉट मेक आउट यूर टॉकिंग ऑफ ए पीरियड और ऑफ ए पर्सन और ऑफ ए पर्सन में आप किसका बोल रहे हो महाराजा रंजीत सिंह का हरि सिंह नलवा का तो आप आप इसको आप शुरू में ऐसे करते हैं पीरियड आई वुड लाइक टू नो मोर अबाउट इज द पीरियड व्हेन महाराजा रंजीत सिंह रूल्ड ओके सो यू कैन यू कैन से दैट आई हर्ड अ सॉन्ग ऑफ सिद्धू मोसेवाला इन विच ही टॉक्ट अबाउट हरि सिंह नलवा एंड एंड ही वाज अ ग्रेट वॉरियर इन द यू नो महाराजा रंजीत सिंह पीरियड सो आई वॉन्ट टू नो मोर अबाउट दैट पीरियड पीरियड करो हिम हिम कर रहे हो हर जगह ओके वो लग ही नहीं रहा पीरियड का बोल रहे हो एनी क्लीन्स अबाउट इन व्हिच आर स्टिल हिडन एंड देयर वर नॉट सो देयर आर नॉट सो मेनी बुक्स आई ट्राई टू सर्च ऑन द गूगल बट देयर वाज नॉट इनफ इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट दैट टाइम आई कम टू नो आई हर्ड फ्रॉम माय पेरेंट्स दैट दैट टाइम ही रूल्ड इन सच अ मैनर दैट देयर वाज ही रूल्ड अब मुझे ये भी यहां पे भी वही लग रहा है कि उसकी बात कर रहे हो महाराजा रणजीत सिंह की ओके एक जगह भी आपने नहीं बोला आई वुड लाइक टू टॉक अबाउट द पीरियड ड्यूरिंग विच महाराजा रंजीत सिंह रूल्ड फिर आप सारा पीरियड आप शुरू में एक लाइन में बोल देते ना फिर आप उसके ऊपर देन इट वुड बी गुड ओके मैम हिस्टोरिकल पीरियड मींस मतलब ईयर बोलना है कि मतलब कोई पर्सन का मतलब रूल का बोलना है यू कैन टॉक अबाउट द पीरियड यू कैन टॉक अबाउट द पीरियड बिफोर द पार्टीशन ऑफ इंडिया द पीरियड आफ्टर द पार्ट इमीजिएटली आफ्टर द पार्टीशन ऑफ इंडिया यू कैन टॉक अबाउट एनी पीरियड गोल्डन एज ऑफ द गुप्ताज गुप्ताज के रूल की वो हिंजो दाड़ो हरप्पा के पीरियड के बारे में बोल सकते हो इट्स अ वेरी वाइड एंड ओपन क्यू कार्ड यू कैन टेक इट एनी वेयर टॉक ऑफ एनी ओके यार मेंशन कर सकते हैं मतलब ईयर वाइज ईयर वाइज आप उस उसके ड्यूरिंग कोई ईयर्स मेंशन कर दो पर वो बहुत रटा हुआ लगेगा अनलेस यू आर अ हिस्ट्री स्कॉलर यस यू आर राइट तो ऐसा रटा हुआ मत लग लगने दो ना रट के जाओ पर रटा हुआ लगने नहीं दो ठीक है यस बी नेचुरल अबाउट इट ओके हां स्टोन एज के बारे में बोल दो किसने बोल कुछ भी बोलो अ पीरियड यू वुड लाइक टू नो मोर अबाउट ओके एंड दैट इज You can talk about anything. It's a very wide and open cue card. कुछ कहीं पे भी ले जा सकते हो उसको. Ma'am, I feel it's very difficult to to speak on its history. Though he was not very educated, but still. दो वाले sentence में but नहीं आता. दो all दो और but नहीं आता. He managed to rule a such huge kingdom. He 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 won many countries. He. W O N की pronunciation. वो नहीं है क्या है अच्छा ओ एन ई की प्रोनाउंसिएशन क्या है ओ एन वन वन है okay? ये भी डब्ल्यू वन है वन वो नहीं है ओके वन है 
he he expanded these areas boundaries to the afghanistan and the in, afghanistan wrong english abhi maine karaya pichle student ko okay yes yeah he has ruled uh, he has increased his boundaries to delhi and bihar has nahi has increased matlab abhi bhi wo zinda hai aur kar raha hai he has increased he increased yeah. triple past okay chalo okay. aaj bahut time ho gaya i'm sorry i'll not be able to make more students speak today but uh, next uh, wednesday hopefully you'll get your turn and uh, uh, practice well this has been a learning experience for me and for many of you i think is it yes did you learn something dr sunny yes. vidya anything you gained from this class uh, not much all right no comments right chalo uh, see you tomorrow 6 pm for the reading class and then 9 pm for the essay discussions okay and uh, gt mm -hmm. students you can uh, please send me the essays in the morning which you want discussed in that class okay uh, sure and i can discuss those essays six seven essays acche se discuss ho jayenge i can try to do 10 also um mere ko pehle bhej dena i'll do those and discuss those pick up the atypical ones from the gt book i'll discuss those our uh, academic students uh, aram se unke liye bhi bahut useful rahenge no no worries for their account all right okay yeah. all right. Bye. good night good night